Today, I wanted to also talk about updating software on your devices. So talking about how to be more secure at work and in your own personal life. Now, a lot of people talk about updating their software on their PCs. So maybe there's a Windows update to do, or maybe there's an update on an application. Firstly, why isn't it important? You need to look at what's actually happening. Software is vastly complex and they finding problems or bugs in the software all the time on a daily basis. Some of those software bugs can be security related. Now, when we talk about security related bugs, we're talking about a threat actor, a bad criminal person wanting to steal data from you or take over your PC, but invariably they're trying to steal money at the end of the day, whether it's from a business or from a person, right? So what we need to do is we need to look at that we're updating correctly. Now, Windows updates have got a lot better. So a lot of them are automatic and they do happen in the background, which is awesome. Same with uh, Apple Mac and so forth. But I do want to point out when it pops up and says, here, do an update and you go, wait, I'll do it later. And you keep doing that, you are going to cause a problem because if it's a severe security update that needs to happen, you could be compromised without you knowing it. So when those updates do come up, you're going to want to update as soon as you can. I understand, obviously, if you're busy on a document, finish that up, but you do want to do the update. The next thing I want to talk about is the operating system updates are pretty obvious. They pop up and go, we need to update. But what's not as obvious is the applications that you use. So if you are using Adobe Reader or you've got a game or whatever it is, you do want to be looking at the updates on those as well. Now, apart from your PC, you also want to think about your mobile device, whether you've got your iPads or your Surfaces or your mobile phone or Android, whatever it is, you're going to want to do the updates on that as well. Again, you can set these to be automatic, but check them. It's very important to check that those updates are happening. Next, what about other devices? So there are so many devices connected on the internet these days, and these need to be updated as well. So if you think about your home firewall or router, that might require an update. Your TV might require an update. And a lot of people go, well, why would I need to update my TV? Well, there's a couple of reasons. You could get better performance and it could run better without those bugs. But there could also be security issues. Can you imagine, you know, if someone hacks into the TV and then uses that to then hack into something else on your network and then steal your data? Same for a corporate device. There was that story once where a casino got hacked into because of a thermostat in a fish tank connected to the internet. So make sure you do your updates.